hello traders so welcome back to our youtube channel in this video we are going to take one minute trade with our strategy i will explain you in detail about this setup so that you can apply the same while trading so first of all let's understand the chart this is one minute candlestick chart and as we are trading over a smaller time frame thus minor trend is important and let me first draw the important level I'll make it white and bold and market is kind of at the support level and this is looking like a fake out in this case so let me check the previous level also yes this is a support level it's an extreme level of support and that's why market is respecting this level so what i will do i will try to take a trade because right now the condition is showing that market can go in the upward direction we got the rejection i placed my trade let me show you in the five second the rejection you can see this is the rejection on small time frame i'm showing you on smaller time frame because people get confused what is a confirmation a confirmation is a rejection which shows that whatever we are uh, planning to do is supported by the trader like uh, as i was uh, i was ready to place a trade in the upward direction for a call market you can see on a smaller time frame on a 5 second chart it shows good bullish engulfing candlestick pattern it supported my view that yes market can go in the upward direction and that's why we can say that this is a confirmation now confirmation needs to be instant and it should be high in volume like it should be very instant like it 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 it, it can't be a, a slow moving candle you need a good strong confirmation then only you can place a trade so first of all let me explain you about this setup as i saw that this is actually market is actually at an extreme level of support and we all know and i have explained this so many time in my video that whenever you see extreme level of support or a resistance you always try to take opportunities because these levels are so strong they can reverse the trend of the market as well so in this case market falls very sharply but you can see it turns out to be that market was not able to break it it turns uh, that you can see this is a fake out market again goes up it closes above and i waited for the market to go down and from the support level itself we got a good rejection and we placed the trade and you can see market is still moving in the upward direction so this is the first trend now as in the current situation i don't see that and uh, we if we have any kind of uh, resistance above so i'm going to place one more trade in the upward direction so i'm waiting for a confirmation market is trying to go up i can see some rejections but still they are not enough i think we have to wait we have to wait for this candle to finish because it formed market is rejecting from this level so you need to wait we have to wait this candle will decide if i'm going to place a trade or not if this candle closes above the recent support this is the weak section that i'm talking about then we are going to place a trade otherwise we will skip this trading setup and it looks like that market will go in the above direction yes we got the confirmation i placed my trade now the reason why i placed this trade is because i don't see any strong level of resistance above the resistance that is uh, that is available right now which is not that strong but still a valid resistance is this level this candle you can see market formed a, a reversal kind of pattern here but 
the next candle it was not able to go down it reverses from the very support level and it closes here so for me it's uh, it's uh, it's quite uh, like i i'm very uh, sure that market will going to hit the resistance which is present here and then it can reverse otherwise it has to go in the uh, upward direction for me according to my analysis i can say that let's see if we is currently we are uh, on the break even side i can't say anything okay we have lost this trade but still if you go by the story the story is still intact market is not able to go in any direction and uh, i will wait for this candle because this is a dozy and we all know dozy means in this season now the next candle will decide if the market will go up or down if let me show you what i'm trying to i'm going to use a candlestick pattern this dozy and will show you a good trading setup in front of you right now without even using the rejection part as well i'm just going to use the confirmation as the uh, like i'm just waiting for a breakout on this scenario and after that i will explain you why i why i'm taking the trade so let's wait and yes it closes below and i have placed the trade now let me explain you why the reason why i took this trade so uh when it comes to dozy everybody thought that it's a reversal pattern but at that's not the case a dozy is a is a signal that market is in in this season right now in this case you can see market is at the resistance it these this is a resistance zone and market formed a dozy now the dozy doesn't confirm that market will reverse from here it confirms that there is an indecision and whoever uh, like uh, the trader who are more in numbers will going to win the battle now for me if this dozy is an indecision it means that this is the complete range this is the upper wick and this is the lower wick this is the range where market is kind of like uh, uh, it's losing its power so for me if market break the dozy in either direction it is going to continue that trend and you can see in this case market broke from the lower section and that's why i placed the trade without even waiting for the rejection because the next candle always follows the previous one when there is a breakout from the dozy section uh, like it, this is uh, like 90% cases i'm not saying that it is an 100% sure strategy so this is what i am saying and uh, the reason why i am i was very sure about this trade is because previously market got consolidated here as well and as if we go by this this is a ranging market and we all know that ranging market market moves from support to the resistance and from resistance to the support and that's why i was very very sure about this trade uh, unfortunately we lost our second trade but no worries this is part of the game we can't do anything as it when it comes to one minute trading it's quite risky and i don't advise anybody who is a beginner to trade over one minute time frame my personal favorite is five minute trading and the uh, like I, I can say that uh, most of my money i have made in five minute trading but i'm doing this one minute trading because you guys want me to do so and that's the reason why i create one minute videos otherwise i'm very very uh, like in love with five minute trading this is what i think is uh, better for a beginner and an intermediate trader as well one minute trading is quite risky but still people don't have emotions uh, like uh, they can't control their uh, urgency to trade and that's why they prefer one minute trading it's not their fault but still if you want to make good profit and want to take this profession on a long term basis i will advise you to stick on a longer period of a uh, like time frame don't try to take trades over one minute time frame although i'm going to create videos on this uh, time frame as well because uh, so many of you are uh, like are wanted to uh, trade over the same time frame so that's it so and uh, right now as you can see market is at the resistance again this is a this is a quite a strong resistance zone 
Now we'll wait for this candle. If this candle closes below the level, the chances are high that market will reverse again. So we have to wait for this candle. Let's see. Yes. So we have, you can see market reverses uh, after rejecting from the above levels. And let's see. And uh, I guess we can go for a lower option here. We kind of missed the trading opportunity. I caught some rejection, but it was not that good. Let me check in the five second. It was sufficient, but I didn't find it working and that's why I didn't place the trade. No worries. That market is full of opportunities and we are going to get one very soon. So as you can see, market is approaching towards the end of this chart which is a good support level market is at the support level and let's see how the market will behave here okay this looks like a clear breakout i will going to place a trade without waiting i got the rejection as well let me show you in the five seconds so that you can understand what i'm telling you you can see this is the candle. it can just broke the level and it was very instant and a strong confirmation by the sellers and that's why i place the trade instantly now let's wait for the result and let me sh uh, let me tell you why I took this trade. So, as this is a support level and it's been broken by a strong candle. Okay, here we have some levels also. No worries. So, so I saw a good candlestick pattern here. It was an instant breakout and a good volume candlestick as well. And as we are trading over in the direction of the trend, I placed this trade. Now, as you can see here, market is again moving in the upward direction and uh, okay, market gives us a good winning trade. I was thinking that I'm going to lose this trade because market was nearly at the end of its expiry. But as you can see, this is a clear uh, case of a clear breakout. Now we are going to take trades in the lower direction more because uh, yes confirmations are coming i think we have to wait for this candle because it will clear my doubt because there could be a case that market can again recover from this so let's wait for this candle and i can see here that market is approaching towards the next strong zone which is also an extreme zone you can see and market previously respected this level instantly so we are going to take a trade in the upward direction by using this level so let's wait it's it's, it's going to take some time and uh, currently market will see there are there is a chance that we can place a lower option here but i will not place any trade here why because we are very near to the support level which is not an a lot not a weak support level it's an extreme level of support and we all know that it can reverse um reverse the market so i will try to place a trade by using this strong level rather than going against this strong level because it can reverse the market instantly and it could result to be a losing so that's why i will wait patience is the key if you are trading over one minute you have to have so much patience you because you're going to get opportunities every now and then so you have to be very very focused and very clear on which strategy you are working on because on one minute time frame you will find opportunities one on one and the another very very instantly so in this case as you can see we could 
place a trade because right now market didn't hit the support level but still i'm waiting because the thing uh, is that it could happen that market will go down it hit that support level and got rejected back very instantly very fast that in within one minute uh, the market reached like this level because it's an extreme level it could have that potential it could have that volume that can reverse that can change the direction very easily so right now market is you can see it's 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 kind of getting weaker the momentum you can see it's dying here so uh, it it gives me more confidence that yes this level this zone is going to work for sure so we are going to use it let me draw that very precisely because it's quite a big zone what we will do we will include this one as well so we have okay so we have this zone of support and extreme support and okay market is actually at the support level that's why it's happening so let's wait as this level is working so we are going to use it and we'll wait for a good confirmation we are going to place a trade now as the market is approaching towards the support level i'll wait if i get a confirmation i will place my trade instantly yes we have got the rejection uh, it was uh, like the market was giving a constant rejection but they were not that strong but at the end i got the rejection and i placed the trade now let's wait so the reason why i placed this trade as you can see this candle closes just above the level this level is working fine here it's an extreme level of support which means that it's quite a strong level and you can see the result is in front of you as i told you that in within one minute it could reach up to this height and it's almost done you can see and that's why using strong levels can help you when you're trading over smaller time frame or even in bigger time frame so always try to stick with the, the levels uh, that are uh, fairly strong so that you can have some edge over the others so right now if we go by candlestick analysis it shows that this is a strong confirmation market needs to go up but because of these small rejections small resistance sorry market reverses for a smaller time but uh, what you can do here is you can use that opportunity to place more trades in the upward direction because if market goes down you will get some margin of safety and by using support levels that are present below the closing of the scandal can be beneficial because if you have placed your trade here you have that margin with you because if you have placed your trade here for a call option there are chances that you could lose but if you are placing your trade like here the chances of you winning the trade will increase significantly so always try to use margin of safety whenever possible i'm not saying that you have to use it always because sometimes you will never going to get one like in this case if i have waited for the market to go more down you can see it will be a missed opportunity so always try to take trades which are in your favor and try to understand if we can get some margin of safety and if you can have that always try to take that so right now uh, currently we have taken i guess four trades and uh, I will try to take one more trade and we'll finish this video because one minute trading is quite energy consuming. I have to like uh, speak constantly, which is very tiring work. So right now, let's let's draw the zone first. So this okay. I will not remove this. I will draw another one. So this is you can see a resistance level market is at the resistance level now there are two things that can happen uh, market can break this level and can go up or market gets weaker here and can reverse again in the downward direction so if we go by uh, like if you saw if you like 
focus clearly on this chart you will see that market is kind of ranging like it's moving with price action it's forming lower low then lower high then lower low and then lower high so you can say that market will clearly going to form the lower high somewhere around here and will continue to fall again now this is a clear thing the second thing that you can mm, can do here like uh, sorry the first thing let me explain you the first thing so if market goes up it form the lower high then you can have an opportunity to place a trade in the downward direction when market will continue its run in the downward direction like in this case market goes down when it goes up the chances work very clear that market at some point of time will going to reverse and will continue its downtrend and you can use that same opportunity to place a lower option trade same you can apply here because there is a hundred percent chance that market is going to continue its run in the future but if you try to place your trade without uh, like uh, uh, if you try to place a trade uh, on uh, by using this breakout in the upward direction the chances are not that high because market can reverse from any level and you are not uh, we are i'm not very sure if uh, if we can find out that this is where market will continue to go up in this case i'm just talking about on this chart only so right now market is going up so as you can see as it's going up we have to wait for the market to get weak like in most cases you will see kind uh, this kind of candlestick pattern the weak section uh, from the above levels the rejections constant rejections from the above level they ensure us that yes market is now ready to reverse so right now as market is going up we are not sure until when the market will continue to move further up in the upward direction but i am very sure that one uh, like a, in a, a few minutes market is going to reverse so we are going to use it and as this is a this is a previous resistance level and it worked really great and if you can see here it's clearly a price action thing like this is the price action and if market goes up it will going to reverse from this level because this is an extreme a uh, strong level this is a lower high swing and i think if market break this swing it is going to change the trend and i guess that market will reverse from this level and after retracing for some time it can go in either direction i'm not very sure about that but i'm very sure that market is going to respect this zone so we are going to use it again because this is a swing high here so right now as you can see as i told you that the wick shows the rejections from the above level market is trying to go up this zone is very important and we are going to use it very very soon because it is going to give us a good trading setup i am very sure that market cannot break this zone why because uh, uh, the market structure is quite uh, uh, will work similarly and this is quite a sufficient retracement for the market and now market needs to retrace back in the lower direction so I'll wait for the market to hit the level and once we have got the rejections I'm going to place the trade instantly so let's wait I got the rejection and was not able to place the trade I'll not place my trade now because the rejection is gone and we are down here but you can see market is respecting this level okay we can yes we can use this level so I have placed my trade now let me show you the rejection first which I was talking about see this is the rejection it's clearly a strong rejection it came from the resistance zone and that's why I placed the trade now let's wait for this uh, okay let me explain you uh, because this is the last trade so I have to explain this trade so 
as i told you that this is a swing high here if we go by price action market needs to respect this level and it needs to reverse and that's why i was very sure that market is going to reverse this candle shows that market is giving some rejection you can see if you look uh, carefully here you will see that market the candle closes just below the wick section i have explained this concept in my previous video that whenever you see this kind of candlestick pattern you will see that the next candle always follows the trend and always reverses and same thing happened here as well and you can see we have won this trade because we have got instant rejection here and so that is it about this trading setup i hope that you have learned something new out of this video and uh, if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment section till then keep trading keep working hard thanks for watching we'll see you in the next video have a good day